Welcome to Ticketmaster Studios. I'm Dave Archer. This is our series where we take a look at some of the players we think could affect the Falcons early on in the draft, either day one, day two. Today, we're going to take a look at the corners, the cornerbacks that swell up against these big receivers on the outside. And this is not a big guy, but he is fierce. Devin Witherspoon out of Illinois, 5'11", about 181, if you will. First team All-American, plays with a fierceness at the corner spot that, de that belies what his, his actual size is. This guy is an outstanding player, finds the ball extremely well. His uh, pass breakup to interception ratio, outstanding. But I love the physicality with which he plays with. It's a fierceness that I think that uh, might be better than most in, in the draft at the corner spot. That's Devin Witherspoon out of Illinois. Let's take a look at Christian Gonzalez. Christian Gonzalez, outstanding player out of Oregon. Another guy that's going to go early on in the draft. And you're going to see some things that look very similar to you. This is a guy that's 6'1", 197 pounds, ran 4'38 at the combine, 41 and a half inch vert. But when you see him play, he reminds me of, yeah, A.J. Terrell. He looks a lot like the product out of Clemson, who's played so well at corner for Atlanta. This would be a good guy to put on the other side of him. 6'1", can go put the football down. I know you see him playing in Colorado. You see him playing in Jujit in Oregon. He played at both places, followed his DB coach to Oregon. So don't be bothered by the fact it didn't matter what uniform he had on. He still played at an extremely high level. This is a guy that could go early on to the Falcons in the draft. Joey Porter Jr., an outstanding player at Penn State. Maybe the more veteran of all the players at the corner position. 31 career starts for the Nittany Lions at Penn State. 4-5 at the 4-4-5 at the combine. Uh, strong guy. Had 17 in the bench at 225. But what I like is the experience, and he plays with a swagger. This is a guy that's got a little something to him, a little nastiness to him at the corner spot. He loves to come up and tackle. Outstanding tackler from the secondary position. Likes to play those physical type roles. Here he is on the cat blitz right here, but he loves to come up and get in your face. Joey Porter Jr., watch out for him. He could be available and could be that guy at eight for the Falcons as a corner. Keely Ringo, I know the name. I know you guys know the name. Keely Ringo in the first play we're gonna rack up for Keely Ringo here is a play I think everybody will remember. I'll remember in Georgia lore, the 6'2", 207 pounder, ran 4'3", 6 at the combine. Yeah, you remember it. The interception that sealed the national championship game. Ringo with the interception return for a touchdown against Alabama, got over the hump and they win their national championship. The first of two back-to-back -back national titles. That's where we wanna kind of go with Ringo. They've won a lot of football at Georgia. He's been a big part of that. But a physical corner, I talked about his size at 6'2", 207. He's got the blitz. He's got the ability to defend the run. He plays the ball extremely well in, this, in, the, in the air. Here's a great play along the sideline against Tennessee. You remember this great win for the Dogs against the number one ranked Volunteers in Athens this last year. So a guy that plays the football well. There's another technique there where he's playing cover two, sinking, and makes the play. Keely Ringo from Georgia. Another guy that could be on the board for Atlanta. Deontay Banks. Out of Maryland, this is a guy that's getting a lot of love here later on in the evaluation. Six feet, about 195, 200 pounds, 42 inch vert. This guy ran 4.35 at the combine. Explosive athlete, just haven't seen a lot of him. He only had 14 starts uh, at, uh, at Maryland, but you can see the athleticism, the ability to get out the football. He's a guy that's got great ball skills. Those aren't the five, only five guys in this class now. This is a deep, group of players at this position. Let's take a look at a couple other guys that, that kind of hit my chart. Uh, Cam Smith out of South Carolina, outstanding player. Tariq Stevenson out of Miami played some really good corner. Emmanuel Forbes, another guy, getting a lot of love at the corner spot. And Julius Prince, a 6'3 player at the corner spot out of Kansas State. I said deep class. These are all guys that are gonna go in the first day or early second day, nine corners. As many as five or six of them could go in the first round. So a deep class of corners. And one of these guys, or a couple, what, why, why be picky, could be good wearing a Falcon helmet. 